How's it going guys and welcome back to another video, it's me Cam from Cam's Cobbler and welcome back to another daily Chelsea transfer news video. If you're new here, I'm Cam, this is Cam's Cobbler and I do daily Chelsea transfer news so you might as well stick around, join the movement, 250 subs soon, very soon. Uh, I'm on the road to 1000 subscribers so if you could help that would be great. I've started an Instagram uh, transfer news page so if you want to get to more up to date you can follow that, link will be in the description and without further ado, today we're going to be talking about... Declan Rice, the Champions League draw, Ben Chilwell, Alonso, Emerson and all things Chelsea. So without further ado, let's get on with the video. Now, starting with Matt Law, who is the daily, uh, the, the Telegraph's um, Chelsea correspondent. He has said Chelsea could make a shock centre-back move that, you know, although we're having lots of outs and we've been talking about Declan Rice, there could be another um, centre-back coming in after we uh, Rudiger goes on loan to Tottenham, I'm pretty sure that's going to be happening. And uh, yeah, just to reinforce our defensive woes and uh, frailties we've been having. Secondly, on defenders, Chelsea have rejected a loan bid from Juventus for defender Emerson Palmieri. That would have been um, seen by Mattia De Schigalo going the other way. Right, so, right backs, left back, sorry. Emerson is been rejected to leave to Juventus I don't know about that however for Inter Milan um, their left back has gone on loan so they're ha um, going to be opening up negotiations to sign Marcus Alonso so this left back business and defender business is all a bit hectic at the moment like it should be because the, the um, transfer window is going to finish on Tuesday so Monday sorry so it's going to be very uh, interesting over the weekend and Friday what happens who leaves and all that but talking about who may come Declan Rice to Chelsea looks unlikely but never say never with Chelsea at the end of the transfer window this is, again was Matt Law who went to the Londoners Blue podcast that's what we got about the centre-back move now Matt Law is very reliable in terms of Chelsea transfer news so you know his words are very strong now moving on to the reason why I've recorded this later than I should have done because this bloody Champions League draw took an age but finally, it's just done, and our group is Group E, and we have Seville, Sevilla, Chelsea, Krasnodar, and Stad Rene. So, we're playing uh, Edouard Mendy's later club, Krasnodar, um, our first time Champions League entry, so, you know, that was that was pretty nice. Not a, not, not a lot, of, not a world-class team in our group, but, again, Sevilla are no slouches. They have won the Europa League, and Rene are a bit of a dark horse. Less, ab less about Krasnodar said the better. We should be winning this uh, group, which would be great. And hopefully, you know, this is this competition is going to start when our team is embedded, and hopefully we have a late cut run. That would be great for the confidence. And finally, going to end on a bit of Ben Chilwell. So Ben Chilwell had a interview today, like many of the signings have had, and I'm just going to run down the main things of what he said. So starting with this. I think with the players we've got here and the players who have been brought in, as well as the coaching staff, it's a good recipe for things that can happen this season. We're looking forward. Uh, we're working a lot on the training pitch defensively in terms of hopefully conceding less goals from set pieces and open play. So we're working hard on that, and hopefully we'll build build team chemistry a bit more over the next few weeks. Everyone starts training more and gets back to match fitness and everyone together a bit more. It should start to gel nicely. So that's good words from Ben Chilwell talking about how we're going to progress through the season. How um, more, you know, promising it is for Chelsea in the later things. So that has been the video. That's me, Cam from Cam's Cobbin. Short one, I know, because I've got to get this out quickly. But I'd like to concise, um, put the news together very nicely for you guys so if you could subscribe that would be great and without further ado i will see you tomorrow for a chelsea versus crystal palace match preview up the gels follow me on instagram please